Hey, what's up? It's December 23rd, 2020. I'm currently working on upgrading my MacBook Pro to macOS Big Sur, and I thought I'd give you guys an update on what plugins work. So far, the only issue I've ran into is Waves version 9 plugins won't install on macOS Big Sur, so I'll probably have to upgrade that license, but there's only a few plugins I use from that version, so I don't mind spending a little bit of money to get that license up to date. Other than that, everything seems to be working so far. Let me go ahead and open Logic and I can show you guys what plugins are working. I almost have them all installed, but um, there's a few left, but I'll go ahead and show you what I got. Okay, as far as audio effects, um, all these plugins are working. So right there is Auto-Tune. It's the artist version. Um, we've got this cool plugin called Speakers from Audio Thing. That's working just fine. We've got Camel Crusher. The GUI is gone, but um, I was still able to install it. I was kind of worried about that one. Melodyne. That's all good. Data Life, Endless Smile, and Sausage Fattener, those are all good. All the Fab Filter is good. Pro Q3, Pro Q2, the L2. All the Native Instruments plugins are working. Isotope, there's Trash, that opened just fine. Um, Sound Toys is working. Sound Theory, Gold Foss is working. Slate Digital, I just have the Fresh Air plugin. This cool little pitch wheel from Quick Quack. That worked. Again, pretty much, I think everything I have is working. The only thing is I can't install version 9 plugins from Waves, so I'll probably have to upgrade those. All the Valhalla stuff, you can hear my computer taking off. X for Records, OTT and LFO tools, good. Um, and then let me show you some software instruments. We got Silent One is working. Transferred over all my presets. Um, again, Native Instruments. That's Absinthe. We got Nexus uh, 3. Works just fine. Spitfire Audio, all that is installing just fine. I'm not done with it, but everything's working so far. Serum installed. Echo Sound works. Skin. <laughs> um, Keyscape is working just fine, and I'm currently working on Omnisphere. I exported all my Logic Pro uh, key commands and imported them in, and those are working great. Uh, copied over all my samples and I also have a lot of instrument channel strips that I copied back over um, as well as uh, these audio track channel strips that I've copied over again everything seems to be working also just recently the Universal Audio console is officially supported so that was kind of the last thing I was waiting on before I upgraded to Mac OS Big Sur. I don't think I really like the new Logic Pro icon. It looks a little squished. Probably one of my favorite features is the new wallpapers. Um, they got the light mode and dark mode. Yeah, these all just look so good. Anyway, hope you guys like this video. I will do some more testing and if I think it would be helpful to make another video, I will, but everything seems to be working. A side note is I would recommend uh, just making sure you have a time machine backup, and um, I went a step further and copied some of the most important folders over to a external drive. Just in case my time machine backup failed me, I would at least have all my logic projects and my samples and some other folders I don't want to lose. 
But other than that, everything's working great. Let me know if you guys have any questions or any issues. Maybe I can try to help you out. Um, yeah, hope you have a great day. Bye-bye.